Believe it or not, two-day delivery is going out of style. But being conscious about the impact of expedited shipping has on the environment is not. Eric Henriksen explains why. Tapping buy on your phone and having a coffee maker delivered to your door within hours is simply too good to pass up, and retailers know it. Just in the last decade, the number of package deliveries made by the U.S. Postal Service has doubled. Amazon announced plans to spend nearly a billion dollars just to make one-day shipping its default shipping method. Even Walmart and Target have free next-day delivery. But here's the thing, getting deliveries this way could hurt the environment. It all comes down to efficiency. Let's say you need a coffee maker and you decide to go to the store yourself. The trip to the store and back releases carbon dioxide into the atmosphere, all for one item. And here's where online shipping is good. You order a coffee maker and it's shipped to you. That truck doesn't just have your coffee maker on it. It has every coffee maker that everyone on your street ordered too. So instead of 100 people making 100 trips, one truck makes one trip. But here's the problem with same day or next day delivery. Because everyone orders at different times, one coffee maker delivery becomes a hundred coffee maker deliveries. These orders are the least efficient and cause the most harm to the environment. One study conducted by MIT found expedited delivery had a greater carbon footprint than just going to the store yourself. That doesn't mean you have to stop ordering from Amazon though. Instead, if you really don't need that coffee maker tomorrow, select two day, five day, or even no rush shipping. This allows delivery trucks to be packed in a way that makes more sense.